What is up, YouTube? It's Tom from Tech Time, and here at Tech Time, we bring you all your tech all the time. So if that's something that interests you, make sure you hit that subscribe button to stay up to date with our weekly content. So what I have for you guys today is the Tudia branded cases for the Essential Phone. Big shout out to Tudia for sending these cases out so I can check them out for the Essential Phone. Uh, the Essential Phone has been out for about a year, so these cases have been out for a while, but the phone is making a resurgence, coming back, and it's coming back fast and hard. A lot of people picked it up on Amazon Prime Day at $250. Now they're pushing out a big deal, a bundle, where you get headphones, 360 camera, and a couple other things for like $399. The price will probably even come down be below that. The Essential Phone is running Android P, which was named Pi. The update came yesterday. So it's definitely a great phone to pick up. I've had nothing... But fun with it. The only thing that I could say is a downfall is the cameras. They're, they are kind of weak. But with the Google a APK camera app, I throw it on there and it's been working out pretty good. But that's enough about the phone. We'll get into the phone in another video. This will be in my Essential playlist. So you can also check out my first impressions on the Essential phone over there. But let's get into the cases. So Tutti has, I think, four or five cases for the essential foam. This is three of them right here. They also make a cover um, case holder for the 360 camera. I didn't grab that, but I did grab these cases. And one in particular really excited me. We'll save that one for last, but we'll get into the first case that I want to talk about. That is the SKN or skin case. This is their clear case. Regular, you know, packaging. They come with like little like Ziploc bags. I personally like the Ziploc bags. You can use a QR code to go to their website and check out their other products. I like these because I flip through cases a lot, so I just throw them back in the bag. Let's see if we can get this baby out of here. And there you go. This thing is as clear as it gets. It does have dot matrix. Now this isn't this is just a TPU like rubber case. Nothing crazy. Has some grip on the sides which is actually really nice to be able to hold. And I like the Essential Phone. It's got this squared off, like old school kind of feel to it. So there you got your speaker. You're going to have your headphone, um, microphone over here, your charging cable hookup, your fingerprint sensor, your camera cutout, and your flash, and then your volume buttons and your power button. So let's slap it on, see what it looks like. Slaps in nice and easy. And there you go. I got the Halo Gray. So as you can tell, it looks really nice. You get your complete look of your phone without any, you know, distractions. Just the color. No branding or nothing like that. So it looks really nice. See it in the light. The Halo Gray is a really nice color. And I love this essential ceramic back. It's, it's different. And the Halo Gray doesn't pick up the fingerprints as much. But I still like to throw a case on it. This is one of the few phones that I have rocked without a case for a little bit, but it's definitely nice to have a case on it, some protection. So you got this grip right here. This grip actually feels really nice in the hands. Let's check the volume buttons. Volume has a nice clicky feel. As you can tell, there's a new volume rocker when you hit the volume button right there. That is the Android P update. I'll have a video dropping on that and what I like about it. Power button works fine. You can reach your fingerprint sensor, no problem. All the cutouts on the back are perfect. The only problem is you will not be connecting your 360 camera with this because of the pins being covered. Tudia does make a case that cuts this out. Um, I don't like the look of it when I don't have the 360 camera on and I don't have the camera on that often. So for me, that wasn't a case that I was really looking forward to. So overall, nice case. Cutouts are perfect. You do have a little bit of protection on the edge. A little bit of raised lips, not too much, but just enough. So let's get into the next case, and that's going to be the TAM. I've had these for some of my other phones that I've used. Studio sent these out, and they have great customer service, probably one of the best that I've dealt with personally. Um, I reach out to the, one of their marketing guys, Evan, and he reaches out in like a split second, and if there's any issues, he gets right back to me you know, with questions or concerns. So here's a Tudia Tam. This is the gray color. So you got grip and like a ridged 
material right here. You get cut out. You get two to your branding right there. And then you see these little raised things right here. That's going to help with drop protection just a little bit. So you're going to get that little extra raised lip. There you go. Inside you have this geometric pattern. That's going to disperse energy or that's what it's there for. Who knows how well it really works. Slap the phone in. Turn it on. Now the essential phone has this little like cutout at the top right there that you can see. So all the cases have that little like notch up cutout. Works good. Cutouts on the bottom. Perfect. You have your little bit of a raised lip. Just enough protection. This is a slim profile case. You get your texture right there. So that's going to allow you to hold the phone and have texture and like a grippy material. So you're not going to drop this thing. Feels nice. I like the smooth back. And you have like a carbon fiber look at the top. Your camera cut out. Your flash. I believe that's another microphone right there. And this one has like a fingerprint rest. So your fingerprint goes down there gradually. It's not just a big drop. Really nice. Two to your tan. We'll get into the prices on these in a second. Now this is the case that I've really, really been looking forward to. And I actually used it over the weekend because I needed to use a case. And I brought this out and I was out on the boat and doing some things. And this case worked great. I really, really enjoy it. This is their Glost case. Uh, G-L-O-S-T, I believe is the way you say it. Yep, Glost. And this is a ceramic looking case. It's not ceramic. It's actually tempered glass. And I always wondered why case manufacturers didn't do more things like this. You get these beautiful phones. This one in particular has got ceramic on the back. Some of them have glass. Or most of them have glass nowadays. And then you get these cases that, you know, most of the time are like this. Oh, sorry about that, Pennywise. And, and you know what? These are nice. They do, they do protect well. But if you have spending all this money on these highly attractive phones, it, you know, sometimes it's a shame to have to cover it up. So with this one right here, slap it open. You can even tell it comes in different packaging. Throw it over there. This is the gloss case. Now the one downfall is that it did get a couple scratches, but there was sand on the table that I put it down on. So I don't think it would be a huge issue without that. But you are probably going to run into some scratches. They're only small scratches. This is tempered glass on the back. And then you get TPU around the edges. Inside, I put a magnet holder, um, metal plate for a magnet holder. But you get the geometric design inside. And it says 2D or under there. Just a really nice looking case. Does attract fingerprints, but so doesn't the phone itself. So there you go. You get your, now this is the black one. Look at that. Let's wipe this off real quick. Hold on. Now that's nice. It's just a nice looking case and it gives you that premium look. Some people don't even know, especially when I was out this weekend, people didn't know phones that well. They thought this was just the way the phone was and they were like, wow, it's a nice looking phone and I really like that. But really, it had a case on it. So there you go. Let's check the volume rockers. No issues. And Tootie does a great job with their volume buttons. Never had an issue. Never had an issue with a cutout. Cutouts are all perfect. You do get a raised lip. Not much, just subtle, but just enough to give it a little bit of protection if you drop it straight down like that. But look at that, that's a nice looking case. Reflective, it is going to take fingerprints like I said, but it's nice. You keep it clean, really nice looking. So now let's get into the prices of these. They will be on Amazon. So there we go, and I actually have... The 2D Emerge case right here, and that's on my G7. That is one of my favorite cases. I always rock it. So you got the 2D hard shell carrying case for the 360 camera. Didn't showcase that here. Here's your gloss case. Now this comes in five colors. You get black, gold, ocean green, pure white, and white marble. White marble is really, really attractive. And I actually thought about grabbing it, but I wanted to get the black because that was just something I wanted. So these are going for $19.90, and they actually have an extra 8% off coupon right now on Prime Shipping, too. So they're really nice. Five colors. You can't go wrong. And you get that nice, attractive, you know, premium look on your phone. 
see what else we got. We have the gloss. Then we have the tan right here. That comes in three colors. You're going to get black, navy, blue, and gray. I have the gray, which I just showed you. And these come in at $10. Bucks. You can't go wrong for a $10 case. And you can get an extra 8% off when you click that coupon for that. And then this is the skin, the TPU bumper case. Uh, minimalist case, glossy clear, but it doesn't come in black. And then smoke. So smoke's going to be like a smoky clear. Then you're going to have completely clear, and then you have black. So the black's different. I personally wanted the clear because I wanted to be able to see the phone, and they didn't have a, like a gray option. The frosted or smoked might have worked, but overall, I thought that that was my best choice. So that's twelve ninety plus another eight percent off you can't go wrong 2d is great like i said they have unbelievable marketing and they also have unbelievable customer service every time i've reached out to them i've had no issues anybody that i've known that has bought one of these cases because i do promote them to my friends and family they absolutely love them they like the slim fit that they give you not too much bulk it's great for people that don't need a ton of protection just want that little bit of uh extra security and also have a nice looking case this one in particular the gloss really enjoy it um, I like that premium look and I like the tempered glass on the back. It's different. It does smudge up and it is probably going to get scratched up over time, but for the price, I'll just pick up another one. So I definitely think these are a great recommendation, guys. If you guys are looking for something for your essential phone, you picked one up on Amazon Prime Day, definitely go take a look at these cases. And if you haven't taken a look at the essential phone, you're just coming across this video and you're interested, I'll have my first impressions linked at the end of the video. And then I also have like a partial review coming up shortly. But I've been super, super impressed with this phone. I only downfall, like I said, has been the camera so far for me. Uh, definitely enjoying it. Anyways, guys, that is it for the video. Hit that like button and hit that subscribe if you are not subscribed and you enjoy this type of content. I hope it does appeal to you guys that are out there watching. And I'll catch you guys on the next one with some more great content for you. Peace.